Lumpy. Not looking at how dodgy are you, Dad? As if. Right, guys, uh, team sheet for the tournament. Those named get practicing, the rest keep stitching. Let's impress Richie O'Driscoll with our bank holiday work ethic. Hmm? So the team get to slack off. We should put my name down now. Not too late, am I? Mm -mm. Is it meant to wobble like that? I think the leg's loose. Ooh, uh, shall I give Gary a call, get him to fix it? Pronto. Are you still going to name the team, though? For you, anything. Captain Aidan Connor. Hmm? Uh, the other four players are Kate, Johnny... Oh, so all the Connors, then? Ugh, they're like the Kardashians. They'll be doing it in the nutty next. Mm. I'm not fussed about playing, son. I'm a bit rusty. <laughs> Good luck getting out of that, Dad. Yeah. We're not all the Connors. Carla's not in. Carla's not in what? Still all the family Connors, though. Yeah, the team. Uh, final two, Kirk. Oh. I could someone nip into packing and tell him. And last but no means least, Eva Price. <laughs> Eva! She can barely hit the table with a ball. Yeah, all right. I just need practice, don't I? Where's the rackets, please? That's... What did she just call me? There's one over there. I'll give you a knockabout. Hmm. OK, um... <clears throat> Promise me, OK, that you'll remember that this is the important bit. Getting old Driscoll's paw print on this contract. Concentrate. Hmm. This is the important bit. This macho nonsense. Don't worry, it's all in hand. So you'll be concentrating on business mm -hmm. and not beating old Driscoll and flirting with our staff. It's not flirting, it's tactics. Tactics. We're going to lose the tournament overall. Then we'll get old Driscoll's in smug contract signing mood. So you're going to let Richie old Driscoll beat you? No, we have to lose the tournament three out of five. We can win the odd game. I mean, Eva's got no chance. And Kate's already agreed to throw away a match. Whatevs. So that's two losses. My dad's a little bit rusty, but if he gets lucky, I'll just tell Kurt to lose his and all. Then I can smash him up. <sighs> The important yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. Contract. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. Right, you could tap dance on this now. Well, we're willing we get this order. Have you seen this? Our Driscoll's are opening a new chain of outlets. Mm. Oh, let's have a look. Now do you believe this is important? What's the damage? Oh, let's call it 20 quid, but I'll give you a discount if you can beat me. Oh, whack it in. OK, you're on. If I win, you get now. If you win, I'll pay you for it. All right, let me shift my gear. <laughs> oh, bit of practice our cheerleading. I'm supporting Gary. Thank you. Me too. And me. Oh, well, Tarsis. But I'll support you, Mr Connor. And I'll support you too, Mr Connor. Talking about support team, where's my dad? Still be on his lunch. Go and smoke him out, Kate. Mm, more fun than watching you glow. Oh, glow, is it? Go, Mr Connor! Go, Mr Connor! You can serve. <laughs> but, I mean... Oh. Yeah. 40 quid, wasn't it? Oh, what? That was a total fluke. Oh, best out of five. Never had you down as a bad loser, Mr Connor. I'm not. Uh, hello, it's like Rocky with bats. We should get Gary on the team. It's not staff. Could we not make him staff? No. Temporary contract, maybe handyman or something? No. No, you want us to win, Mr Connor? Mm. Of course I do. Bet you're glad I called him now. <laughs> You know, I'm sure Richie will be happier if you're one of the losers. Contract. Ready for kick-off? It's table tennis, Kaz. Yes, Kirky. Well, that's the point. I sent Kate out to find my dad, and now I'm two players down. Or just cause a beer in an hour. That's all right. They'll be in the Rovers. I'll nip there on the way to Rise End. I'll give her a ring now. Come on, if your dad's out, you might need me. Let's sort T's and C's, yeah? <sighs> Sally. Yes, Mrs. Connor. I'm sure you're the only one here that realises what this is all about. <clears throat> it's not about the tournament. It's about getting the contract signed. You know, old Driscoll's are opening a chain in Knutsford. I could live in Knutsford. Right. And Richie O'Driscoll would be much happier if they won. Especially him. So your job, right, is to make sure Aidan remembers that. <laughs> 